Hello, thank you very much for tuning in. My name is Hans. I'm the head of happiness and the founder at niceflats.at, short term rentals in Villach. I will split, split up this video into two parts. The first part is about um, nice flats. I will give you a short introduction because I never did this before and nice flats is already 18, 19 months old. And um, the second part is about the thing most of you tune maybe in because of the answer about furniture in Villach. I'm right here in Italy because Italy is only um, the border is maybe 20 minutes from Villach and the beach is maximum two hours from Villach so I'm sure you will love it once you're here although we have the most beautiful lakes in Carinza directly and so let's start First of all, I want to thank you very, very much to all my guests and all my partners of the Nice Flats Network. Um, I started Nice Flats 18 months ago. I think at that time I already bought my first one or two flats. And I was lying completely sick at my sofa bed in my living room. And I wanted to make something bigger than the normal landlord easy money business um, so I struggled a little bit about it and I was lying there on my sofa bed and I thought okay that will be the moment for nice flats so I designed the logo and the idea and I did the whole business development thing within one week while being completely sick and while I was lying there on my sofa bed I looked at this Amazon Alexa thing at this time it was pretty new and as you maybe know if you google for something you maybe get 10 12 search results on the first page but while i was looking at this amazon alexa and as we all get more and more convenient i thought okay if somebody asks alexa for short-term rentals in Villach, there should be only one answer and this answer is nice flats and that's my vision and that's what I worked for the last one and a half years for Nice Flats. And in fact, the business went through rooftop. We already have a lot of partners and we already had a lot of guests. We already have right now a lot of guests. And I don't even know how much units we have right now because only my partners make it possible that we also adapt units which are um, about 100 square meter and bigger. And also my partners care about having flats or that we can offer flats which are for students. So we also have flats for um, where we have two or three sleeping rooms. So it's also a great student crib. Um, okay, I think um, that's all about nice flats right now. And um, I think this is a good moment to deliver content because uh, my wife is pregnant now in the seven months and then you um, either you do it now or I will do it never. Um, I'm planning um, one episode about the most common questions you have while relocating or moving to Villach because maybe I was already the first smiling face in Villach for people relocating here maybe maybe for 200 people or more. And I know exactly what you want to know. I know all that Meldezettel stuff at the Meldebehörde. I know you're worrying about the internet connection. I know you worry about the furniture, um, how to find the, the long-term flat and all that stuff. And today I want to begin with the furniture in this episode. And first of all, I need to say that I personally hate this furniture thing because I invest in um, things which have value. And I know when I unpack furniture, the price doesn't matter here in this case. It's worth zero. No, it's not even, it's, it's worth less than zero because um, let's say I, I rent a flat and I buy all the furniture there and my project is finished after one and a half years. I write, I write my landlord, okay, I want to move out and he will answer me, okay, dear Hans, no problem. Um, nice that you have been my tenant. Um, now you will have a deadline of three months to move out until we do the key handover and when we do the key handover um, please go sure that there is no furniture left because I need to do new pictures for my future tenants 
and um, please go sure all walls are as white as they were when you moved in okay so that means you have to get a rental car and you need to um, recycle all that stuff so um, you need maybe a, another 100 200 euros for that so furniture is not even worth zero it's worth minus 100 minus 200 euro in the same moment you unpack it okay so um, now i want to share two ideas with you how you can um, handle the topic the first big thing is um, the facebook marketplace a lot of a lot of people have the same problem like you um, so they need to move out and they want to put their furniture online in the Facebook marketplace because they are hoping somebody is um, somebody will buy it and put the things out of the flat so you can make pretty pretty good deals there so go to the Facebook marketplace look for furniture and filler please go sure you use the German words go to Google Translate enter wardrobe look for the German words um, and look it up at the Facebook marketplace the second big thing is the biggest marketplace in Austria you can also buy used cars there you will find all the flats there and um, you have also a very big marketplace for all kind of stuff and you will also find a lot of furniture there um, I will put the link directly down under this video. If you don't want to look it up for, um, I will spell it directly here. It's W-I-L-L-H-A-B-E-N dot A-T. Also there, I think it's not translated yet into German. Um, and all the furniture will be published in German words. So also go sure you look for the German words. I hope you liked this video and I was already able to give you a little bit value. Um, I will do a lot of future videos because I know you're interested in, about um, trusted partners of me concerning rental cars, you want to know something about the school system, you want to know the things about the internet connections, you want to know where you can find all the flats and that stuff and I will give you a lot of recommendations. I also have direct contacts. And so thank you very much for your attention and a lot of those videos will follow. I hope you like them. If you like them, please give me a thumbs up. It would be awesome. And thank you very much. Have a nice weekend. See you soon. Bye-bye.